the prophets talk about the, the orphan and the widow and the needy, and when Jesus talks about uh, the people who suffer and the poor, it's not about the poverty. It's not about the suffering. It's not about the oppression. It's about how the human spirit responds to that. And, uh, you know, Hassan made reference to my own transformation, which I will talk about. My transformation from a, a Jew born in the United States in 1948, which means perforce uh, growing up as a Zionist, my transformation from someone who accepted, bought, and endorsed the Zionist narrative um, to someone who feels that unless we can overcome Zionism, uh, which has hijacked Judaism and which is killing Judaism, um, that transformation came about when I witnessed the occupation for the first time at, you know, as a middle-aged man, having lived in Israel and, and, uh, and visited Israel many times but never seen what was really going on didn't come from witnessing the occupation so much and from the confrontation with that evil. That was a big, big part of it. The real transformation for me and the real, um, the real miracle for me in terms of finally understanding who I am and what I'm supposed to do as a human being and as a Jew came from meeting the Palestinian people. And the real, I think what concerns me most of all is not what's happening to the Palestinians. The Palestinians, as you saw from Dr. Gobert's presentation, and as you see when you meet, when you go there and when you meet Palestinians here in this, in this country traveling, uh, I'm so too moved by what happened this morning. It's hard for me to, to remember what I was going to say. What I, my real concern is for the uh, Jewish people uh, who are living under those circumstances. It was seeing my Jewish cousins and nephews and nieces at those checkpoints doing what they had been taught to do and conditioned to do to those other human beings, it was seeing the look in their eyes and what's happening to their souls.